out of the Carabao Cup. Danny, how do you assess that one? Fairly disappointed. I think um, it was a messy performance from us. I think credit to Newport County. They um, played at 100 miles per hour. Um, they did what they've done to, to many clubs um, in cup competitions in recent years here. Make it very, very difficult for you. I think we weathered the early storm, got complete control in the game. Um, got two, got one nil up, uh, one nil up, two one up. Then um, missed chances at, at will first half. I can't tell you how many chances we missed. We should be out of sight. We're not. Um, coming at half time, and we were disappointed with how we defended in the first half. We hadn't hadn't done well enough in that area of the game, and then come out second half and didn't improve in that area. And I thought um, ultimately. That is what undone us. Forget the the chances we created, and yeah, absolutely, you could uh, you could say we could have been more ruthless at that at, at, at the top end of the pitch. But no, defensively, as a, as a collective eleven, by the way, because the way we defend, it's always an eleven man job. Nowhere nowhere near good enough tonight, and to come here and concede three goals is yeah, really really uh, disappointing. It was a frantic first half, almost like a basketball match end to end. So what do you think went wrong in the second? Well, the reason it was a basketball game in the first half is because we didn't play with enough control because you have to make sure that you sustain your attacks. You have to make sure that you stay in so that the defence have an opportunity to build the defence behind it. I mean, they played um, and left four up the pitch, which was really offensive from them. Um, we just had to make sure that we stayed in and attacked the the, the seven players that, that, that were there. And if we'd have done that, we'd have got overloads and we would have... Um, yeah, created probably even more chances than we did. But more importantly than that, we'd have had time to build a defence behind our attacks, and then we would have been able to stay in rather than the game feel like it was so end to end. And yeah, like you've rightly, rightly described a, a basketball game. To look at the positives, two goals for Ronan Curtis, which will only do the world of good for him, aside from the result. Yeah, I think I think some of our offensive play first half was really, really good. I mean, like I said, created so much. Um, have to be more ruthless. I thought Ronan to get two goals was a positive. I thought Dane Scarlett was unplayable first half. Um, and he's just a goal away from 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 scoring scoring an awful lot of this level. Um, but yeah, and no, I was disappointed with 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 the, the the defensive aspects of our game. And you know, I just said to him in there that if you don't respect the game and you don't you're not willing to do all the what people call the ugly things. I don't think they're ugly things. I think I think they're really important things. You know, the the, the defensive footwork, getting up to the ball, getting pressure on the ball, um, winning your defensive duels, winning your second balls, using your body, aerial duels, all of these bits that build a performance. All of these things that we've done so well in the first six 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 games of the season, but we didn't do it tonight and. Yeah, of course, I think nine changes. Yeah, we, we do, but we made lots of changes against Cardiff and we, we did well that night. Um, and yeah, some of the young players found it difficult this evening. I said to them beforehand that they this game would be much tougher for us than Cardiff. Because Cardiff, the expectation, there was no expectation. Here, this was going to be a proper a proper gunfight. And, um, you know, credit to Newport because I thought that they, they, were, they were excellent. Um, but, but for us, no, we'll... Uh, we're, we're disappointed that we um, that we didn't play with a lot more control because we, um, we 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 should be able to come here and 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 put a much better performance on the net. Now on to Saturday, a trip to Fort Port Vale. Obviously disappointing to exit the Carabao Cup tonight, but an opportunity to focus on the league for the time being. Well, I think you know we we knew that we we've had a very very busy start to the season. Um, Saturday, Tuesday, Saturday, pretty much throughout throughout August, we we, we really wanted to win this uh, win, win this game tonight and 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 progress in the competition. But you do have to prioritise, um, and as well as that, if you want to be a successful t club, then you need a you need a squad that is fit and ready to go. So it made absolutely absolute sense to to freshen the group up and give give players that did really well against Cardiff further opportunity. Um, we saw on Saturday the effect that the, that the, the squad can have on the, on the outcome of the game, but um, no, there was there was um, 
Yeah, no, we didn't get to our levels tonight, and we're, we're, we're really frustrated about that.